museum here is part of a structural project, a strategy of development that the city of Liège is trying to create by developing different cultural institutions in Liège. And now this new museum, La Beaufrie, which we want to use as something to really promote Liège around the world and internationally. I'm Chloé Beaufailly, I'm responsible for the Museum La Beaufrie. You are here in the Parc de La Beaufrie, which is in the center of Liège. The first exhibition starting in May is called En plein air, in open air. The story about this exhibition is this change in the manner of painting. When the painter decided to change his relationship to nature, we have very rich collections, but still we wanted to work with these collections and work with another partner who will help us promote Liège. That's how we started to work with the Louvre. This collaboration ended up in a collaboration for three years time. So this museum here has two different levels. One first level will host temporary exhibitions. This is the case with the Louvre and with the exhibitions that we are organizing with the Louvre. A second exhibition will start in September with the name 21 Rue de la Boétie, 21 Boétie Street. The lower level of the museum will host the permanent collections. For us, it's very important to focus on this specificity that the museum has, which is the fact that it is situated in a very nice park where people in Liège really like to come as soon as the sun comes up and just enjoy this quietness. The building dates back to 1905. It was built for the first World Exhibition Liège hosted. A hundred years later, so in 2007, the Liège authorities decided to refurbish the building. And for that, we relied on an architect, which is very well known. His name is Rudy Ricciotti. He was the architect of the Museum Museum in Marseille and also from the Islam department in Le Louvre. So architect Ricciotti's project was chosen because it's really linked the ancient building with a modern structure. But the, this link between the two, between the new extension and the existing building was coherent. It was made in a way that the modern part would fit nicely into the park and would fit nicely to the existing building. But also in itself, it's a piece of art.